country. Good morning. The Great Wall They're of China is one of the world's most famous and ancient landmarks, and new secrets are just now being discovered along its 5,500-mile path. Here's NBC's Ian Williams. This is the usual image of the Great Wall of China. But further afield, its derelict watchtowers and crumbling ramparts are still being explored. In Hebei province, it disappears into a vast lake, which is where we traveled with American explorer Stephen Schwankert, determined to unlock the secrets of the submerged wall. It's about three or 400 meters worth of wall that was submerged when, when this whole valley was flooded. Let's go and take a look. Go. Let's take a look. The wall snakes down into the cold and murky depths of what's now a reservoir. This section built during the Ming Dynasty about 650 years ago. The best part of it is we get to have a sort of 360 experience on the wall. You get to be above it, beneath it, around it, to the side of it. It's a, it's a view we don't get otherwise. On the surface, the dive was monitored by William Lindsay, one of the world's leading Great Wall explorers, who's trekked more than 1,500 miles of it. Are there any uh, structures like uh, watchtowers down there? There is. There's a watchtower right in the middle. The watchtower sits in the gloom, 50 feet beneath the surface. It's remarkably well preserved, as are a series of defensive archways. Lindsay believes this was a crucial strategic point in what was a river valley on the route to Beijing. Any valley was perceived as a potential invasion point. From the Chinese point of view, they knew they had to defend a location like this very well. Well, this might not be the easiest way of exploring the Great Wall of China, but it does give a unique perspective on this incredible structure. For Lindsay, it serves as another reminder of a love affair that's kept him in China for 25 years. You can see the tower. This area was flooded in 1977, shortly after the Cultural Revolution, when there wasn't much concern about preserving the country's heritage. So the actual water level now, then, is just about... Just yeah, yeah. Just, just a tad below that, is it? Yeah, just here. Lindsay's preference is still for exploring the wall on foot though he hopes that efforts to preserve the wall will be helped by unlocking the secrets of the lake, which also hold an endless fascination for explorer Schwankert. You know, it's just amazing. I mean, you, can, you can't dive the pyramids, but you can dive the Great Wall, so, yeah. so that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Ian Williams, NBC News, Hebei Province, China. Just fascinating. The uh, mystery continues. Are, are we sure it's not Roker playing a practical <laughs> joke? <laughs> Good thing. <laughs> He's doing the footprints right now. <laughs> Just ahead, a live concert, Labor Day concert on the Plaza for Matchbox 20. First, your local news and weather.